Siege of Bastogne was a battle between German and U.S. forces. Bastogne is located in Belgium. All seven major roads in the Ardennes region run through Bastogne. It was part of the larger Battle of the Bulge. The battle lasted from December 20th to the 27th. The Germans started their attack on Bastogne on December 16th. The attack was part of the Ardennes offensive. The German goal was to take the port of Antwerp and had to take the roadways in Bastogne. The Allies never expected the Germans to attack through the Ardennes, so they had little defense in Belgium. The main U.S. force that was sent to stop the Germans from taking Bastogne was the 101st Airborne. The 101st was a worn-out unit that's seen a lot of combat and were sent to Belgium to rest. They arrived on the 19th just in time to cut off the Germans. They were worn-out soldiers who were very battle-tested. They were under the command of General Anthony McAuliffe. The 101st was stretched thin and outnumbered. They set up a perimeter around Bastogne. They were heavily concentrated to the north and east, so the Germans decided to circle around and attack from the southwest. The Germans were attacking with four reinforced divisions, two of which were armored. By noon on December 21st, the U.S. forces were surrounded and cut off. They were lacking cold weather gear and ammunition, food, medical supplies, and leadership. They had no air support and no supply drops, but the 101st continued to fight off the German attacks. On the evening of December 21st, German commanders sent the famous letter to U.S. forces asking for their surrender. German General McAuliffe received the letter and replied nuts. Over the next few days, the 101st refused to let their lines break. The lines bulged but never broke, which is why it is also known as the Battle of the Bulge. The 101st men kept fighting even though they were surrounded, worn out, starving, and freezing, which is why they later became known as the Battered Bastards of Bastogne. On December 27th, General Patton's 3rd Army broke through to relieve the 101st. The 101st were relieved to see Patton's army, but would never admit they needed to be rescued. The 101st fought bravely and never quit, and we owe a lot to them. <laughs>